Santa Claus and the Three Bears Once upon a time, there were three bears. A huge papa bear, a middle-sized mama bear, and a little baby bear. It was a cold Christmas Eve and everyone was busy preparing. Papa Bear was putting up their Christmas tree, Mama Bear was cooking Christmas pudding, and Baby Bear was hanging his socks on the fireplace. The tree was decorated and the stockings were hung when Mama Bear called everyone to dinner. Dinner is ready, called Mama Bear. She put the Christmas pudding in a great big bowl for Papa Bear. She put some in a middle-sized bowl for herself. And she put some in a little bowl for Baby Bear. But when they started to eat, the pudding was too hot. Let's have a stroll through the neighborhood, see the Christmas lights, and wait for the pudding to cool. That's a good idea. Wait for me. Meanwhile, Santa, on his sleigh, was down to the last house on his list. Ho, ho, ho! Only one last house! Then I'll be eating Mrs. Claus's Christmas pudding! I'm a little bit hungry! Said Santa Claus, and he heard his tummy rumble. His sleigh landed on the roof of the Three Bears' house. The Three Bears were on the nice list, so they will receive Christmas presents from Santa. The bear's house shook and rumbled as Santa Claus tumbled down the chimney. Santa picked himself up. Hmm, what a delicious smell! He looked around and saw the pudding on the table. Oh, Christmas pudding! What a wonderful idea! Santa excitedly exclaimed, and took a spoonful from Papa Bear's bowl. Oh, 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 this pudding is too hot, he said. And he tasted some of Mama Bear's pudding. Oh, this pudding is too cold, he said. Santa decided to eat some of Baby Bear's pudding. Mmm, yum, this pudding is just right, he said. And he ate it all up. Santa saw three chairs. It wouldn't hurt if I rest a little bit after that yummy dinner. He then sat down in Papa Bear's chair. Oh, this chair is too hard, he said. He sat down in Mama Bear's chair. Whoa, this chair is too soft. And then he sat down on Baby Bear's chair. It was neither too hard nor too soft, but just right. So then Santa bounced up and down a little bit just to get comfortable and... Crash! The chair broke and Santa landed. Boom! On the floor! Santa stood up and decided he needed a nap before heading home. The North Pole is quite a sleigh ride from here. Might just stretch my legs for a little bit. So he went into the bedroom and saw the three beds. Santa climbed Papa Bear's bed. Oh, this bed is too high. So he then proceeded to Mama Bear's bed. Oh, oh this bed is too low. He said. Lastly, he tried Baby Bear's bed. Oh, this bed is just right. So he snuggled under the covers, stretched his body, and fell fast asleep. The three bears came back from their walk and excited to eat their Christmas pudding. Mmm, I'm hungry, Papa Bear said. I'm hungry, Mama Bear said. 
Me too. I'm so hungry. Baby bear said. The three bears approached the table and had a big surprise. Somebody has been eating my pudding. Papa bear said. Somebody has been eating my pudding. Mama bear said. Somebody has been eating my pudding. And eating it all up, cried Baby Bear. The three bears looked around and realized that someone had indeed been there. Somebody has been sitting in my chair, Papa Bear said. Somebody's been sitting in my chair, Mama Bear said. Somebody has been sitting on my chair and has broken it to pieces. Baby Bear said. The three bears went into the bedroom and they saw their beds. Somebody has been sleeping in my bed, Papa Bear said. Somebody's been sleeping in my bed, Mama Bear said. The three bears looked at Baby Bear's bed. Somebody's sleeping in my bed and he's still there, Baby Bear said. They saw lots of white hair and white beard, a red jacket, and two black boots sticking out from the bottom of the blanket. It's Santa Claus! exclaimed Baby Bear. Oh no! Ho ho ho! Promise you won't tell anyone you saw me, please! said Santa. And he reached into his sack and pulled out a big present for Baby Bear, a medium-sized present for Mama Bear, and a little present for Papa Bear. Baby Bear was so happy, he forgot about his eaten pudding and broken chair. Can I open my gift now? asked Baby Bear. Not until the morning, darling, said Mama Bear. Ho, ho, ho! Sorry about the chair. I'll bring you a new one next year. Merry Christmas! Ho, 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 ho! Santa went up the chimney and back to his sleigh. Santa shook the reins and the sleigh took off into the cold winter night. Merry Christmas! Ho, 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 ho! The End Merry Christmas! Give a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel. Thank you.